Well, we love our coffee on Saturday morning. That's right. And today we're spicing things up a little bit for the holiday. Why not? Aliza Bobot is here from City Girl Coffee with some festival coffee drinks. How are you? I'm well, thank you. How are you? Good. And d folks might not know, I always buy City Girl whenever I thank see it at the so grocery much. store, thank but you. it is local right it here, is. right? Yes. Yeah, we actually do all the production up in Duluth, um, but we've got our part of our team is down here and we've got distribution all over and Kowalski's, Lens of Barley's, Hy-Vee, Whole Foods, Amazon. So we're all over the cities. Anywhere you can find us. Congratulations. Thank you. Did it start up in Duluth then? Yeah, actually. So my parents started um, Alec of Coffee Roasters in Duluth, Minnesota in 1990. Um, and I came back in 2013. I've been living on the East Coast. And so I came back and um, decided that I wanted to take over the family business. And um, so we started the City Girl brand in November of 2015. And we've oh. just kind of grown it since there. So we've been doing production in Duluth since 1990. Um, and then we've expanded. Well, Congratulations on that. Thank you. All right, so we're going to make a couple drinks. Yes. Coffee drinks are fun. Yes. Because, you know, people are together for, you know, breakfast and yeah. or even evening, like the, the nightcap of the night. You know, they want a little decaf. So tell us how you uh, make this. So we've got a couple different drinks. I'm going to make the vanilla cranberry drink for you. And then we've also got um, a salted caramel recipe um, that I think you can find Fabulous. on the Care 11 website later. Okay. Um, so to make the white chocolate cranberry, what we're going to do is we're going to put a little bit of um, white chocolate in the glass and you're going to grab some steamed milk. So what I did was I just kind of steamed it and you can whisk it beforehand or if you have a frother or a steamer at home, something like that. Okay. So you're going to put about eight ounces of steamed milk on top. All right, of the chocolate. Of the of the steamed milk, yep, on yep. top of the white chocolate. And you're yep. going to stir that in until it's um, melted. Okay. And then you're going to take your strongly brewed City Girl coffee. So strongly brewed, how is that different than regular? Like, so you are you using more coffee or? We are, we're using more coffee grounds per water than we traditionally would if you were just drinking the water. Or okay. you can use espresso. If you have an espresso coffee Fabulous. maker at home, you can okay. use espresso as well. All right. So you're going to add the coffee in there. And then we've made a cranberry syrup, and so just basically taking cranberries and and sugar and water and boiling it down into make a, a cranberry simple syrup. syrup yeah. Simple syrup. Okay. You're gonna put about two ounces of that in. Okay. You're gonna add your vodka. So we vanilla might need vodka. a bigger cup here. We might need a bigger cup for all you're gonna of do this. We do about just a top, little top off we of vanilla. We weren't able to put enough of the vodka in there. I'm kidding. So. <laughs> Vanilla, huh? That's right. <laughs> the vodka should go in first. It should, but you can oh, add it no. in at the end or I'm not. I'm kidding. Put a couple cranberries in there. A little shave white chocolate on top. Oh, that's so pretty. What a pretty, oh, here we go. We're making, a, we're making a mess because, yes, typically you'd probably want to do it in a little bit of a bigger glass, but since we've got our City Girl coffee mugs for oh, you. Oh, that's so pretty. Making a mess in the kitchen this morning, but that that's is how so we do pretty. it at the holiday time. <laughs> oh, great. And so, and so, and you have the other one online, but how do you We've do it? we got the you other can just one online. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. So it's a, um, a salted caramel. So you're going to take um, caramel sauce. Again, you've got your vanilla vodka. So you're going to put the vanilla vodka in this time um, first, two, two to two and a half ounces if you want it. Okay. Um, and then you're going to add your caramel sauce, um, the, the hot coffee as well, the um, uh, steamed milk again, top it with uh, whipped cream, and you can put a little salt, salt. on top. Oh, that is good stuff. Yeah, but we've got okay. the, all the recipes for you. Well, we've got your coffee you. here. What's your favorite flavor? Can you pick a favorite? Is it like a child? You can't pick a favorite? I do. You know, I have to say my favorite is our Guatemala, but okay. I, I just like it because it's just medium bodied. It's a great everyday coffee. Um, it's kind of got a nice chocolatey finish, but if you like something a little lighter, the Blondie in Brazil is a fabulous choice, and our Sumatra is a really, really nice um, option if you like dark, kind of more earthy coffee so wonderful got something for everybody well Aliza thank you so much thank we do you. appreciate it. these are great recipes and uh, once again we will go ahead and put all these on care11.com